Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for all Sun, Moon and Rising Aquarians. I want to say thank you for being here, thank you for coming back. If this is your first time, please subscribe, thumbs up, likes and share. This is going to be a wonderful, wonderful week for you Aquarians. They're good, positive energy. It is the week of the Empress. The Empress is the Energy Vibration of the number 3, which is the Kracht of the, in, uh, the Holy Trinity. Use um the positivity of this week to manifest it's going to be a very fertile fertile week a very, a very um a positive fruitful week a week that is going to bring balance in your life in so many different aspects and this aspect is going to be a positive positive it's going to be a time of creativity variety and um a myst mystery in this week so be aware of that the materialistic and the security and comfort beauty and satisfaction that you're looking in this week it's going to be a week where parents and children are connected so it's going to be a wonderful week as i'm looking at your week it's going to be a week of uh, highs and low because uh, um what is happening is that the energy of you feeling as if uh, you are alone is here and this energy is the number five energy and you feel as if you're an orphan because certain things are happening and you feel alone you feel as if you're in the cold and you feel alone and yet still um this is just what you're feeling at this moment because you need to open up and reach out to people open up and reach out to people as i look at your week um you have positive energy Friday is going to be an extremely, extremely good week, uh, day for you. Friday is your best energy vibration day. Your week is to bill with money. You begin the week on Monday with money and in the middle of the week you have money. You're positive and this is why your focus is the Ten of Pentacles, a family thing. So you sitting down and being and feeling so alone and as if an orphan is really, really strange because the Ten of Cups is here helping you to bring in um, certain aspect and certain energy vibration in your life. So you are feeling as if uh, you're out of it and, uh, you know, you're alone. But there are families around because the Ten of Cups is your energy vibration reading and also the end of a burden okay so whatever you're feeling here as if uh, you're so burdensome and that sort of a thing it's just something there's something that has to do with your work which i'm going to express on um monday is the energy vibration of the hurt wednesday is the energy vibration of the hurt is four of pentacles and um the knight of pentacles um your own energy vibration is here uh, on Thursday that has to the effect of men and there is jealousy and both sides and these men are vibrating on a very negative energy vibration so be aware you um, Gemini men what you're doing because there's a lot of hate you're sending out to other people and you know this has uh, as we look at this energy vibration of four of pentacles the energy of the four of pentacles we have the energy of the four of pentacles what this energy of the four of pentacles is saying is that for the women this is a sheer positive positive um um financial situation for the woman a zero positive um it's as if you're saving you're you know that you are saving for something and this energy vibration is here helping you and saving for certain things certain aspect that is coming in so this is really good this is wonderful as we look at um tuesday we have the energy vibration of the sun but uh, be aware because somebody is trying to steal something from you be aware of this thing because whatsoever is happening on a sunday hope in your eyes because people are not being honest around you and people are uh, talking around about you but also trying to steal things what they could from you so be aware of this energy that is going on it's horrible because the sun comes up and yet still these people are trying to profit from you it's 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 profit and stealing something so be aware so call upon the universal angels and ask them for divine intervention in whatsoever is going on 
as we move on we have in the middle of the week the knight of pentacles knight of pentacles is a wonderful energy and the knight of pentacles is bringing you news of changes and these are wonderful changes that are coming in so this changes that is coming in you're at a crossroad that you need to make changes in your life and this has to do with changes either financial changes but you're at a crossroad that you need to make certain changes in your life and this knight of uh, pentacles is coming to help you make these changes in whatever way on tuesday the energy vibration of uh, um uh, your own energy vibration of the king of sword is in reverse and this has to do with some it doesn't have to be with you, you aries people but it has to be with uh, a knight of sword that is coming he's no longer coming at you you he this person is radiating so far negativity that the the, the energy of uh, this this is what is happening this is this is this is this, this is this is what is happening um, um jealousy heart hate towards someone else and this knight of sword is just but he's in a reverse form um he can he can leave out uh, all of this uh, evil wicked jealousy and thinking and that sort of a thing but it's not going to affect you because what you're doing is that you're trying to change and who you are whosoever you are you are sending out this hate and jealousy and, and hunger to someone else uh, um, be aware because you yourself it's a reason why you're doing it because the person ignore you you need um, to radiate on someone else uh, and it is it's uh, whenever people behave like this with a jealousy and that sort of a thing that mean you're not vibrating on a, a, a good energy vibration it's bad so whoever you are heal yourself because you really need to be healed on Friday for the women it's going to be an extremely feminine days if you connect with someone of um, a dark hair or dark skin woman she's going to bring you and help you to bring out the star who you are the true person the true beam um, she's going to bring blessings in your life okay so if you it's a feminine day it's a day for the women and if you connect with people of brown hair brown eye or brown skin they're going to help you to bring out the best in you. As we move forward, we're looking at the energy vibration. On Saturday, we have a water energy, which is the moon. There's a lot of enemies in an organization that is working against you, that is so jealous, um, extremely jealous people um, in an organization because this, 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 enemies in an organization and it can be some place if you have left um, a work or that sort of a thing if you have left a company or you have left a certain group of people this is what is showing up here on Saturday hate and jealousy so be aware this is wonderful and I've never ever seen it with a sign of money and your inner wisdom is going to um, guide you and let you know that money is coming to you money is coming to you and it's if this person um, this king of sword which is your own energy vibration why he is so hard um, bad minded and that sort of a thing is because he knows something about you know okay let's look at it let's look at him let's deal with him his prosperity whoever you are um, and you're a man you're the king of swords you have so much hate jealousy and boast towards somebody else that your luck your um the positive that the positivity that is there in your life for you cannot come out because you have so much heart and jealousy towards other people okay you break your own energy vibration that's why nothing good is coming out in your life because you hold so much heart and hate and jealousy of everything that people have and against someone someone who is out there 
and I'm getting the message that this is coming from not a Gemini person but it's come it it, it is a Gemini it, it, it is a comment from a Gemini person okay whoever this person is it is a Gemini person because um, when I look at it um, the Aquarians you guys are not don't have you guys are jealous but this is just really heart and jealousy what is coming here so this person obviously is blocking their own elevation process because of that but I guess he has he or she has to learn whatever is going on in an organization you know the women you have to be um, careful in this week because whatever is going on in an organization as I look you are here and your positive energy is up here which is the Sun and uh, there are people who are like you know picking picking on your positive energy and it's like for people who uh, are doing something for them for themselves we're working for themselves and uh, uh, the, the people see that they're doing something but they the, uh, the aid that is there they, they other people are trying to pick off of it but they can't do that because it's your own it's your own DNA it's your own blueprint so there's a lot of jealousy going on and people are trying to block you but all of a sudden just call upon the universe and said release me from this blockage break all blockage that people have set for me just break all blockage that people have set for me call upon the universal angels your guides and angel break the blockage that people have set upon my work break the blockage that people have set upon my life break the blockage that people have set upon my house break the blockage that people have set upon my throne break just break ask the universal angels to break all of these negative attributes Rebuke that people have sent to you and tried to block you because obviously someone here she is trying to do something she is using her own inner wisdom and intuition to bring out something in the world but yet still there are people from out of an organization and people and this is like a lot of people they're her enemies but they're under her this is beautiful the enemies are under her now she has overcome and overpower her enemies. So whoever you are out there, when it, this is the situation, um, you're a woman, and this situation has been occurring. You're trying to build something in your life, but yet still, your enemies are now under, under. They have no effect on you. They're not reverse, but they have no effect on you. Um, within this week in the middle of the week or sometime in this week it's going to affect people in different ways you're going to make a changes over your career new doors of opportunities are going to come up but there are some hateful um, deceitful people here people who are trying um, to um, have certain effect on you and your life and be aware of this because what is happening is that people or constantly coming at you and there is going to be you have to make um, a decision and a change in this week it is going to be wonderful um, and um, life seems to be you know um, balancing out so um, the energy vibration that you have um, is this card which is so wonderful and I read what it says it says the secret to getting rich is knowing that you already are and then acting like it do tell me who manage your assets and those gems are they real see you in the cans so this is wonderful so it, what it's saying is that the secret to get rich is knowing that you are already rich and then act like it and that is it's like fake it till you make it so I'm leaving you with these wonderful messages and I'm saying namaste. I hope you will return next week. Please like, share these videos and thumbs up and we'll talk next week. Namaste.